Hello, Leo. Welcome to your love reading. This is going to be for Leo, Sun, Moon, Venus, and Rising. We're going to look at how your person is currently feeling about you. So let's see what's going on here. Okay. We have friends and we have crossroads. You may have someone, you may be dealing with someone who is now doing a lot of partying or confiding in friends because they seem to feel like they're at a crossroad. They feel like they need to make a decision. Yeah, <laughs> see? Party and regret. So they may regret their actions with you. And if you see that this person is out partying and they're with friends and they seem to be living their best life, I honestly feel like it's to distract themselves and because they feel like they need to decide what they need to do about the situation with you. Let's see what we got here. What's going on with Leo? We have beliefs. Dreaming of you. Okay. So we got dreaming of you. We got meet the family here. Okay. Baby boom just came out. Expecting, conceiving soon, children involved, family tree. Someone may be conceiving soon or you guys may have kids together. We have baby D, get a snack. Tough cookie, aggressive, F the police. Someone's friend or family gets more mad at things you go through, be careful. There's someone protective here. There's someone who may not like the person that you're dealing with, like they may feel like this person is out partying and that you shouldn't worry about them. That's what I'm feeling, like someone wanting you not to be affected. We have belief, interracial dating, connection, different outlook on life, coming from different cultures, lack of faith, pray more, surrender when all else falls. See, maybe from two different worlds here. There's a lot of differences between the both of you. And I am getting the message that there's a difference in the way that you both deal with separation or any issue. This person may be the type to go out and just avoid, you know, to not think about it. But let's see. What are the energies between the two? Person on Leo's mind. What are the energies here? So this person, yeah, <clears throat> you see, this is what all the partying is about. They're carrying a lot of feelings here. I feel like you're needing to understand that their partying is because of the situation with you. Like they need to, they want to release the baggage. And they're kind of, either they're playing hard to get or they just don't want to hear anything from anyone at the moment. They're not accepting any offers. So if people are offering them love when they go out and party, I see them turning down offers from other people. Them, them, you know, being free and going out is just to take their mind off of the situation with you. We have the magician. This is your energy. So a lot of you are very much in control and you may have something new that you're focusing on. Some of you may be in school or got a new job or a new project, new business that you're working on. You're just in control of your life at the moment. You may just see your person over there living it up, but I feel like, like I said, it's just it's just a distraction. Energy between the both of you. I feel like you're both equally feeling that there's a loss here. I feel like you both are feeling sorry, meaning you both may be looking at the situation thinking, okay, I did that wrong, they did this wrong. There's this feeling of, there's this, there's this feeling of both being sorry or feeling a little bit sorry for how things have turned out. Even if one person did worse than the other person, you could be dealing with a fellow Leo or a Pisces. I am seeing that this person's next move towards you. They may shift their energy and be more friendly, but they are trying to be strong and not fall for the temptation. Like they may feel tempted to just want to be with you or flirt with you again but they're trying to be strong about it because they may have felt rejected at some point i feel like they don't want to feel that way again so they just want to you know fight their feelings the ten of pentacles 
I'm seeing that in your near future, there's a lot of abundance coming in financially. You may have to choose a path. Some of you may have some choice to make when it comes to work. <clears throat> Sorry, I just ate a bar that has like oats in it. You know how that'd be. So this, this um, energy is you having to make a decision either to do with this love situation or to do with your work life. But I see that whatever decision you make, you, you're going to be taken off. A financial increase and a lot of forward movement here. Some of you may receive communication from this person. It could be you seeing them and wanting to communicate or vice versa. But there is this overall feeling of betrayal. Of an ending, a tough, painful en ending. Tough and painful ending that's happening here. Let me look at their feelings towards you. Okay. How are they feeling about Leo? How's this person feeling about Leo currently? My current feelings towards Leo. In the dark. Could be dealing with the Pisces. They're kind of in the dark about how they feel. Either they're feeling very deeply or they just don't know at this point. Page of want. There's three pages here. Three pages. Page of swords, page of wands, page of swords, page of wands, page of pentacles. And the page of cups did come out earlier. So when we speak about communication here, there is something that somebody wants to say for sure. You may receive a message soon, or you may be thinking of sending a message, but there's definitely a message. And it's, it is in the position of their wishes. So they may wish to communicate something to you. They do have a fear of being completely left out in the cold. This could be why they're partying because they feel rejected, feel left out. And they're seeing the relationship as, you know, the four of cups. So they may be feeling like they're not, their offer is being turned down. So how do they deal with it? They go out, they connect with friends, they take their mind off of it. King of Wands, Eight of Cups. Could be dealing with a fellow Leo. There's Aries and Sagittarius energy. But I am seeing that they could have fire in their chart, but they could be very passionate as well. What's blocking is the fact that they've had to walk away from you who they have so much feelings for. That's the thing. That is, that is why they're doing all this partying or being so distant and not communicating because they feel like they've been forced to walk away from someone that they love. This is their way of dealing with it. Their next move is a page of pentacles. They got pages, their next move and a page is their wishes. So there's a very good chance that they're going to be reaching out. And it could be when they're drunk or when they're out partying or having a drink knight of swords king of cups so we got the tower here this whole situation could be a tower moment for this person it could be something that just sent them into a shock and made them just quickly find a way to deal with it but In the position of what you need to know with the Knight of Swords being here, I feel like there is going to be this person wanting to speak very soon. Why the Knight of Swords? Three of Wands. Five of Swords. Okay. This seems like someone who's been waiting, so they just make a move. They just make a move. K 
careful though because if this person is very egotistic they may try to say something just to feed their ego or make it seem like they're not even bothered why the page of wands yeah they really want to offer this ace of cups but they're stuck in this eight of swords unable to free themselves from the thoughts stuck in their head why the king of cups i look more at their feelings i see them coming forward leo and i feel like Either they want closure or this will be the last time they try. It could also be Leo. It could be a situation where someone does offer them love. And out of all the people that they've turned down, they may take this one person's offer in the, in the future. If their offer is still being rejected, because when they view this relationship with you, they're just seeing themselves as being rejected right, left and center. Even if they haven't tried to reach out to you, I feel like you not saying anything makes them feel like it's done or they're rejected. Why the moon? Page of Wands. Page of Swords. What is going on here? This is, you're, you're reading is a book, Leo. You're reading is a book full of pages. Page of swords, page of wands again. This person wants, I feel like they want to know the truth about how you feel about them. They want to get to the truth. I feel like they may message you because they want answers. I feel like their ego is really kicking, like they're feeling rejected. They want answers. I'm getting the feeling, Leo, that this person felt like you guys had a really good connection. And they're really confused as to why you guys are not connecting anymore. They may have had dreams about you. Some of you may actually have a child on the way because the pages can be kids. If you guys have kids together, they will be reaching out to speak to the kids. I'm getting that for some of you. Um, if you're a man, this, this person. Okay, if you're a man who deals with women, this woman wanted to have a baby for you. She wanted to carry your child. Um, it could be a woman who really wants a baby. Um, I just feel like, wow, because of the baby card here, the expecting, conceiving, children involved, all these pages could be that you guys have kids together or one on the way. They may call you about like m making it seem like it's about the kids. If there's no kids involved, it's just this person wanting to get answers, wanting to know what's going on just kind of going for it with this knight of swords just going for it going ahead and messaging you so they can get their closure so they can feel better because right now they're just they're just kind of going all out here okay why the page of swords please clarify the page of swords goodness sun leo energy the breakup see two of cups in reverse this is a breakup they want to know why i feel like they want to know why and i feel like they've been waiting and they've been waiting for things to improve like they're waiting for the steam to blow off and for there to be a more positive vibe but they want to know why you guys and i feel like some of you feel that they should know why but this person, their mind, they're having all kinds of thoughts. So they could be thinking, okay, it wasn't that bad. It wasn't that big of a deal. So why break up? They could be an Aries for some of you. But they are going back and forth in their head. Why the page of pentacles? Okay, um, Leo, this person. Again, with the pregnancy thing, because we have the Empress. If it's not you, it's not you, but there is a pregnancy story here for some of you. Where their next move is to reach out because you're pregnant or they are pregnant. 
<laughs> some of you, if you're like I said, if you're a man and this woman is pregnant, it may be what ties you guys together and they're calling you. She's calling you to tell you that, okay? It could, maybe it's a lie. It could be a lie. It could be the truth. We do have the card to support it. But there is something here um, to do with kids. Something that may tie you guys. Um, kids may tie you guys together. And they may use the kids as an excuse to reach out to you. I've never seen so many pages in a reading, Leo. This is like... This is a catfish first. <laughs> what are the love messages for Leo? It's safe for you to love. Open your heart to give and receive the highest energy of all. I don't know where this coming, where this is coming from. Maybe some of you are worried about um, falling in love again. Yeah, this could be the one you've already met the romantic partner you seek. Could they be the one? I really feel like it would be up to you because I feel like this person low-key misses you. But I feel like it's you who is just doing your own thing. Probably focused on school or work. Romantic feelings. Your feelings are real and worth exploring. So Leo, you could low-key low have feelings for them still, but you're just playing hard to get. But I feel like it's them who does have feelings for you for sure. If you don't, then you don't. But I definitely feel like they do. Because no one is going to be in this energy for someone they don't have feelings for. Okay. Retreat. It's time to disconnect from the world. I feel like that's you, Leo. Disconnecting. We have deja vu. It's a re repeat of the past. Codependency. They may be codependent and finding it hard to let go of you. And again, um... Okay, we got love versus money. This codependency, I feel, goes with this situation. We got down here their next move because I feel like something they do will be to tie you. Or, like I said, tying someone with, preg tying someone with pregnancy or using the kids as an excuse to communicate. It's, it's, it's them wanting to stay stuck to you. We have dead ends. Some of you are like, hell no. But my gosh, Leo, what in the world? Like I'm trying to figure out why these two cards are here. It's, it's either someone, your family member or someone has warned you about this person or they just don't like them. And you guys could just be from different worlds, different backgrounds, different cultures. These are just side messages here. I feel like it's mostly this person being unable to let go and them kind of using something, some excuse to come forward and wanting to know why. Wanting closure. They are really stuck. They really are stuck. Okay. So Leo, this is what I'm seeing for you. I hope this was helpful. Feel free to check your other placements if you want to know what else is going on. Like if you enjoyed. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.